Hi, this is a simple tutorial on how to use Aurora Disk to God on your modded Xbox 360. The default way to store games is by simply copying all the game files into your games folder, but this only allows you to launch games from either Aurora or Freestyle. I'd like to start and play games from the official dashboard, and this is only possible by using Aurora Disk to God. First of all, if you haven't already, you need to install the Aurora Disk to God installer, which is easy to install. On Aurora, press the back button and go to modules. In German, it's called scripts. Then open the Aurora repo browser and select Utility Scripts. Here you can download the plugin. Now insert your Xbox 360 game disk and wait until the Aurora message shows up saying the disk is inserted. Then you can start the installer. It will ask you where to store the files. To make them show up in the Xbox dashboard, you need to install the game to HDD1, content and the folder with a bunch of zeros. Select the folder and press Y. When it asks you to create the new game directory, select Yes and it will start copying the files. When it's done, it will ask if you want to scan for new content in Aurora. Select Yes, go back to Aurora, and you will see that the game now appears in your library. Now this was a single disc game. Some games like LA Noir and GTA 5 are shipped on multiple discs, which behave in different ways. LA Noir has multiple play discs, where you need to swap discs as you progress further into the story. In this case, you copy all discs into the bunch of zeros directory. The game will then automatically detect the extra games files and won't ask you to swap. For GTA 5, which has both a play and install disk, you simply insert the install disk and start the game, letting it install like you would on an unmodded console. Then use the Aurora Disk to God installer to copy the play disk into the bunch of zeros directory. When you have all your games copied to your hard drive and go back to the Xbox dashboard, you will see that all your games now appear as if you had bought them from the Xbox marketplace. If you're using Protostealth to connect to Xbox Live without getting banned, it will also load the game covers and images. 